everybody! Today we're doing something really special. It is Sunday, so happy Sunday, everybody. It's my favorite day of the week. We get to just calm ourselves down and not work so hard and relax and just enjoy the Sabbath day. But um, today is, I think it's actually Memorial Day tomorrow. We have lived in places in the past where we have been too far away from the cemeteries where our family's buried. And we're finally at a point where we are, my mom knows exactly where they are and she lives with us and we are gonna go find the graves of our family and make a special day out of it. We brought some picnic items that are in the back of the car and we've rearranged the whole car. So usually Max sits right behind me and then all the other kids sit in all the other seats, but we put Max in the very back in the middle in a bigger car seat that he's ready for. And then um, all the other kids are in new seats and hopefully it will be a good setup so they don't fight so much. <laughs> Anyways, um, we're heading over to the cemetery right now and I think this will be a really good experience for us and our kids to kind of just um, show some respect to the people in our family who have left this earth, so. And Max is taking a nap. And you have to be very polite. You know, this way. You have to be very respectful. Because these are people's family. And you wouldn't want somebody to jump in to on top of your family and hurt them and show a disrespect. So we show lots of respect. We walk to the sides of the graves and not on top of the graves, okay? Cemetery talk. What the rules are in a cemetery or etiquette. And uh, then we had the double cemetery talk. <laughs> my mom ex didn't expect me to also give that talk, so she gave it to him again. <laughs> so if they're misbehaving, that's gonna be bad. Hi. There's a lot of people. So who are we here to visit today? Okay, so we have, my sister actually died when she was just a, a preemie baby. She was 12 days old. She was born at like six months and died. So that's my sister right here. Melissa. And this is crazy because that's, that's my aunt and uncle, but they're not dead yet. Oh. <laughs> they paid for their funeral already. And they yeah. got home. So they ha is that interesting? Because I was so like, no, wait, they're still alive. Where do where do they dig out? There's no space to dig though. Maybe behind? I don't behind it on the other side maybe? Okay. So then this is also isn't this Glenda Appleine? So yeah. this is this is my grandmother and grandfather. So my great grandma and great grandpa. Was 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 he Okay. Where's your grandma? My grandma that just buried. She actually just died. About here. That probably in was it September? She passed away in like September. She actually fell and mm. broke her hip in the nursing home and then it was just a few days after that Mom. she died. Mom. But this was it's actually the first Memorial Day since yes. she died. Yeah. She's right here. This is Grandma Grace. She's on the ground right here. 
so we're the first ones to visit her then. Since there's no other flowers. Where do you want to get buried when we die? <laughs> I had thought about it. Like, <laughs> um, just kidding, don't do that. I don't know. Where do you want to get buried? Um, Make it easy for a family to just get buried right here. here. I guess so. That's how you get. Uh, uh, you know, it's not so hard to like. Do you know where your mom and dad want to get buried? Oh yeah, I want to be buried by them. Oh, dad, where do you want to be buried? Probably somewhere around here. It might be down on the out there in that field. <laughs> What, Charlie? You have to be married. Only when I die. That'll be a long time. I don't want you to die. I want you to die. I want you to die. Aww. What a sweetheart. I don't want you to die either. I, I feel the same way. Either. You know what? Let's look at this. Look. Do you know who's in here? That is a baby that Grandma had. That's my sister. But when she was just a little baby, she died. And they put her body in the ground once she died. And you know what we believe? Mom? Our spirit and our body come together when we're born. But when we die, when we die, our spirit goes up to heaven and our body goes in the ground. And then one day, one day we're all going to be resurrected and our body and our spirit are going to go back together and we're going to be really happy. I don't want you to die either. I don't want Why did you say I don't want you to get buried? You'll get buried one day too when maybe when you're really old and you die. But you know what? Your spirit will go up to heaven and mine will too and we'll say, Oh, it's so good to see you! Just like that. And you know what else? When we die, once we die, we'll get to see Grandma Robbins. Remember Grandma Great? Do you remember Grandma Great? And we'll get to see my sister who I've never got to meet before. And we'll get to see our grandma, who I've never got to meet. And you know what else? We'll get to see all of the family members that are just up in heaven, that are watching us right now. They're watching you right now. And they're crossing their fingers and they're hoping that you make good choices so that we can all be back together again. Was quite enjoyable. We got out of the car and Max did wake up from his nap and that was all my fault because I put him in the stroller. <laughs> I was like, no, he'll stay asleep. He didn't stay asleep. So he's had like 15 minutes of sleep all day, which is crazy considering he usually sleeps for like three hours at noon and it's 4 11 right now. Yeah, that's dangerous. Yeah, it is. He'll throw off his nap schedule forever and he'll never take naps again. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, We're just in for a really cranky night. That's yeah, it. I know. I know. We're going to have to like let him sleep in little tiny intervals and then finally put him to bed at a good time. But it was so sweet. I was not expecting Charlie to react the way that he did. I was just like, I think I was just... I wasn't really joking around, I guess. I was more just like, oh yeah, where do I want to be buried? I don't know. Ha ha ha. And Charlie's like, buried? What? What are you talking about, mom? <laughs> like he started freaking out. And obviously, I was being insensitive with the kids around talking about me dying. But I didn't really think about that because I was talking to the adults and then Charlie couldn't handle it. And I had to sit and explain to him for a really long time what I meant or or what happens and how it's it's all gonna be okay you know it's all gonna be okay death is like the scariest thing besides torture I guess on this earth <laughs> and yet it's also such a part of life and I just it's so interesting I was really contemplating while we were there how I feel so weird just walking around when there's bones of people that are loved that are no longer living just below our feet 
then they're like decomposing and it's just, it's like a really weird thought, but it's also such a part of life. And yet we don't really think of it that way. Cause everybody's gonna die. Everybody is. Yeah. Try not to scare the kids too much. <laughs> but anyways, now we are going to another cemetery because we decided to do kind of make a day trip out of it and kind of go to all of the cemeteries nearby that we know that we have family at and go in search of those names of the people that we are related to. So anyways, it should be fun. Let's go and see if we can find them. Michael's just happy because it's Pokemon Community Day. <laughs> he got to catch them all. <laughs> and I did. So, uh, we did not find the gravestone we were looking for. We found one that was in our family, Stephen Markham. But we haven't found any others, and that's okay because we're all tired. And I was like, I'm done. I can't. So anyways, it was a good day though. And I hope that it will raise questions in the kids that they can ask us about all of our ancestors and family history family history and maybe we can learn a little bit from this I experience we another, uh, i think we were but now we're not because everybody's tired after looking for a headstone that we never found <laughs> we looked for a long time probably an hour so anyways i hope you guys liked this video and uh we're gonna relax and enjoy the rest of our sunday afternoon and i'll see you guys next time bye <laughs> Thank you for the pictures in Rampage.